I'm 39 and a half weeks pregnant, and uh, Ben's taken to treating me like Willa. Let's go. <laughs> I just had to. I had to get that. <laughs> He doesn't want his uh, pregnant wife to fall and, and lose the uh, the giant belly. So I'll put sheets on, okay? So we'll just leave the shark and the baby there. Yeah. Baby? And then you put the baby in it, yeah. yeah. The last few months have been a bit of a blur. A nightmare, a miracle, normal life, crazy life, sadness, happiness. There were good days, there were bad there were good and bad days. There was a birthday. Whoa! Can't believe I'm 14. There was the pancreatic cancer diagnosis of Ben's mom. We welcomed a new life to the world. There you go, buddy! Oh, there you go. We said goodbye to another. It's been joyous, sad, emotional. Let us explain. 39 weeks right there, people. She's uh, doing awesome. I'm trying to bounce the baby out. I'm not sure if that'll happen. <laughs> they tell you always to do lots of walking. So we've been doing a lot of walking. I feel great, really. It's, it's kind of nuts. It feels so good, I think, in the last like couple weeks of pregnancy. It's been really, really good. In the evenings, I'm kind of like dead. I've been having some Braxton Hicks contractions, so that's kind of always a bit interesting. But, you know, feeling amazing out hiking in the woods. Can't really complain. <laughs> One of us is really interested in some. She, she spent the entire day with her grandmother, which has been really great having the supporter family here at home. Uh, and Grandma tuckered her out. So it's been kind of like a weird week, I'm not gonna lie. We had started out this week with a planned hospital birth, and now we're looking at what it might take to have a baby at home. Meanwhile, I'm 39 weeks pregnant and it's imminent. We all start with a doctor and not a midwife, so it probably won't work out, but we're gonna try. We're gonna go and look into it. It's like they always say, the fear is in your head and the more you learn and research a topic, the less that fear is, so. I think we're getting there. If that's gonna actually happen, I have no idea because we just kind of are moving that direction. We're at, a little late to the game. And it might come out tonight. Tonight, tomorrow. It's not like you're sick. I think that's a big misconception with birth is people think, oh, you need to go to the hospital. It's like a medical procedure. It's not, it's a very natural thing. We watched a YouTube about it and it went really well for this girl. So we're thinking, why not? So we're just trying to set up for a home birth and we're not quite ready yet. Uh, I think I'll do some laundry. It's probably a good time. Three in the morning. I probably have quite a few hours. It'll be dry by the time the baby comes. A little stronger tonight hurts a little more we're really last minute with this home birth um finding a midwife we finally found a midwife yesterday and uh well we got the supply list end of yesterday so we haven't been in the store yet i'm going back to bed Says go to the hospital on the phone. Yeah, it always says that. <laughs> <laughs> what was the difference between it? Uh, this one was duration of one minute, two and a half minutes apart. They're closer. That's not very nice. They're getting closer together. But it's too soon. Which, I don't know, could be early labor. You'd be jumping right into it. I thought it was false labor, but 
the midwife who we were trying to switch to to have a home birth thinks it's real labor and she thinks it's coming quick and she thinks we need to go to the hospital. So we're not gonna be able to go to the home birth because we just weren't ready yet. We just met our midwife today. So we're going back to the doctor. And it's very, very painful. Go quick. Then I think we need to go. Call the doctors to you. Oh, we'll just come in. Oh, oh! This is going way faster than I expected. This is crazy. the hospital uh we'll meet at the uh we're going to emergency okay okay yeah emergency it is okay bye See there Oh. <laughs> 
Last Wait, time we're having a baby. Oh. <laughs> I can't feel any cervix. <laughs> uh oh. No. I think Ashley, we might have met really early on in your pregnancy at Dr. Gill's office. Okay. But you probably don't remember no. me right now. <laughs> uh, 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 I don't want to leave too much shit everywhere. Let's get some of that. You want to keep your bra on or you want to get a yeah, girl? Yeah, I'll keep one. Okay. For now, just for now. I think I'm going to throw up. So do this okay. pushing right from the start. Just like a big poop. You can do it. Let it grunt it out. And were you okay with oxytocin just in your an injection in your leg? What's After? Yeah. So, yeah. Just a heads up, that'll happen. We'll, we'll warn you when we do it, though. Did you feel the baby's head at all? No, not yet. So we want this guy's up. You go up high enough. Big deep breath and hold it and push. I can move here. There you go, buddy. Stretching up too much? Yeah. yeah. Okay. There, there you go. go. There you go, buddy. Oh. There you go. Oh. 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 It's okay, you can leave that. I didn't even watch. I don't mind them dirty. Oh. 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 Daddy, these are gonna be for you. And you're gonna cut right here by the white plastic. Yeah. That feels a bit chewy. Looks like squid. Nice. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I can't believe you're here. What happened? It's so funny. All I wanted to do was wash my hair. <laughs> <laughs> If I washed it and it blue dry, it wouldn't have got anything else. Oh my gosh. Hey, buddy. Oh. 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 So we wanted to introduce you to Bodie West. He came fast and furious this morning. Absolutely a complete whirlwind. Um, baby's perfect. I'm doing really good. Uh, I'll give you a bit of an update more later, but uh, I'm doing great. Ben's pretty proud. Water deck. Oh, I know, but be. Ah! Yeah, you tell me. <laughs> we are so relaxed the second time around. It's partly because you know what's coming. It's partly because it was a three-hour labor. Um, <laughs> it's just so much easier. Three hour labor and delivery. Yeah. You know what is how funny Ben is relaxed. He's just like he's just like <laughs> just thinking like he's won the lottery or I have won the lottery. That's His ridiculous. Wife pushed the baby out in three hours. Yes. From the time he had to get out of bed to the time the baby was delivered was three hours. Literally. Thirty seconds after she pushed it out, I said, You wanna make another one? <laughs> Answer was no. <laughs> My baby boy. Let's go catch some fish. All right. Well, I just want to demonstrate I do stop for red lights <laughs> when my wife's not in labor. Bunny? Oh, thank you, Willa. You're gonna share your bunny with Bodie? <laughs> <laughs>